Today I'm going to show you how to make these really cool superhero pumpkins. And we'll start by making the Spider-Man one. So take a pumpkin, carefully cut off the top, and clean out the contents. Once it's emptied out, we can start drawing on the design. I started by drawing on the eyes, and then the web. Join up all the lines, and draw the outline of his face around it. It's probably useful for you to copy a picture. The pen I'm using allows me to wipe it off with wet kitchen paper, which is really useful to help correct mistakes and get the design right. Once you're happy with your design, make the lines nice and thick, and as even as possible. Next we're using a sharp knife to cut in between the lines and remove the skin of the pumpkin. Do go carefully and it does take quite a long time. We basically want to remove all the pumpkin and keep in place the black lines. If the ink smudges and gets on the flesh of the pumpkin, don't worry about it too much, we'll sort this out later. Keep working your way around until it looks like this. Then use your knife again to cut out and remove the eyes. Clean out the openings. Then wash off all the ink with some water. Dry it off and if you've still got ink on the pumpkin flesh, you can remove it by slicing it off with a knife. And there we have our finished Spider-Man pumpkin. And we'll be testing him out in a bit. Next I'm taking another pumpkin which we're going to use for the Batman logo. As before, cut off the top and empty out the contents. I'm drawing on the logo by starting with the outside surround and if I make a mistake I'm just wiping it off and redoing it. Then I'm drawing on the bat logo. This will be held in place with little tabs on each side. Once you're happy with everything, start cutting it out. You do need to be very careful, as it is so intricate in places. So go steady and try to be as neat as possible. If you take your time, it should come out really well. And after I cleaned it up, this is what I got. So there's our two superhero pumpkins. I put a small flashlight torch in each one to light them up. Just dim the lights and look at them glow. Pretty cool, huh? The Spider-Man mask looks really fantastic. The web lines are nice and intricate and the whole face just glows. And the Batman logo is really cool. It would look great on an upstairs windowsill beaming out. Together they're really impressive and they'd look great at a Halloween party. They'll impress your guests and they're really fun to make. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you want to see more amazing Halloween ideas, you can click on the links or take a look at my YouTube channel page. Stay safe, have fun, and as always, thanks for watching.